Hello again and welcome back to day six with me, Adam Bostock, here at Alto Hearing. It's been nearly a week since we started this journey together and what a week it's been. You've started to integrate your hearing aids into your daily life. You've learned about their care and begun to understand the sounds around you in a new way. Today, though, we pause the practical advice to focus on encouragement and reflection during this adjustment process. Adjusting to hearing aids is more than getting used to a new gadget. It's about relearning to hear the world. This can be both exhilarating and challenging. You might have noticed sounds that you hadn't heard in a long time, or maybe you're finding certain noises unexpectedly loud or peculiar. These experiences are all part of the journey towards better hearing. It's easy to focus on the negative side and things that are a bit weird or a bit uncomfortable, but reflecting on the past few days, consider the moments where you noticed a positive change. Perhaps it was hearing the birds on your morning walk or the sound of a loved one's laughter. These moments, no matter how small, are significant victories in your journey. However, it's also completely normal to face challenges during this period. You might feel a bit overwhelmed by the intensity of new sounds or frustrated by the ongoing adjustments to your new hearing aids. This is all part of the process and it's important to remind yourself that it's okay to have these feelings. Adjusting to hearing aids is not about just the physical device but also about the mental and emotional adaptation. During these times the importance of patience cannot be overstated. Just like learning a new skill, adapting to your hearing aids takes time and practice. Every day you're training your brain to interpret sounds differently. A remarkable task that requires both resilience and perseverance. A really good idea is to keep a journal of your hearing journey. It doesn't need to be anything too big, just write down the sounds you rediscover each day. Note any challenges that you face and reflect on how you overcome them. This not only serves as a reminder of how far you've come, but can also be incredibly encouraging on days when progress feels a little bit slow. You can use these notes as well when you return to see your audiologist for the follow-up. It's actually really helpful for us. The path to better hearing is unique for everyone and it's filled with ups and downs, but the destination, a richer and more connected experience of the world makes every step worth it. Keep up the good work and I'll see you tomorrow for day seven.